In nature, light is everywhere. We see it in the simple beam of a flashlight and in the powerful rays of the sun. The speed of light is the fastest speed currently known to humankind, a cosmic speed limit that no object with mass can ever reach. In astronomy, we often hear the term light year. A light year and a human year are completely different concepts. When we speak of a year, we are referring to a duration of time. A light year, however, is a unit of distance. Specifically, it measures the distance light travels in a vacuum over the course of one year. In the vastness of the cosmos, Earth isn't even a single grain of sand. If we used our common units of length, like kilometers or miles, to measure cosmic distances, we would be dealing with astronomical numbers. Therefore, scientists established this new unit of measurement, the light year, to calculate the immense distances between galaxies. To put this in perspective, we know Earth's equatorial circumference is about 40,000 kilometers. The speed of light, however, is 300,000 kilometers per second. This means light can circle the Earth 7.5 times in a single second. It's a staggering concept to grasp. One light year is approximately 9.46 times 10 to the 15th meters, 9.46 quadrillion meters. This is a distance almost beyond human comprehension. In 1977, the United States launched the unmanned space probe Voyager 1. It travels at a speed of about 17 kilometers per second. To compare, if a passenger jet could reach this speed, it could fly from Beijing to Shanghai in just one minute. And yet, after traveling through space for 42 years, Voyager 1 has only covered 21.1 billion kilometers. If it were traveling at the speed of light, it would have covered that same distance in just seven hours. Here's another example. The airplane is one of the fastest modes of transport for humans. At the cruising speed of a typical passenger jet, it would take 1.2233 million years to travel a single light year. While the distance of a light year is astonishing to us, it becomes almost insignificant on a cosmic scale. It takes light about eight hours to cross our solar system. To cross our own Milky Way galaxy, however, takes 100,000 years. If we expand our view to the observable universe discovered by the Hubble Space Telescope, it would take light 96.1 billion years to traverse it. At human speeds, such a distance is simply incalculable. Thinking about this, one can't help but be struck by the smallness of humanity and the infinite vastness of the universe. In the grand scheme of the cosmos, even our entire Milky Way galaxy may be nothing more than a single speck of dust. All right, our journey is coming to an end. This is the captain of The Traveler, signing off.